The Honourable Member for Nunavut. Now, Madam Speaker, um, first off, I'd like to start with it's an honour to be here to advocate for people in my territory. Um, as an Inuk who has grown up in Nunavut, suicide is no stranger to myself and those in my territory. We all know it way too well. We are put into and now live in foreign systems that do not work for us. We support, we need support and allies to assist us, work with us, and most importantly, to listen to us. We cannot, we cannot face this problem alone like we have been for so long. There are many factors that contribute into suicide. Lack of or poor health care, housing, living costs, and transportation. Many live in poverty. Many live in poverty and health, uh, mental health care is almost non-existent. We are often left on the back burner, ignored or forgotten. Nunavut Mute have been asked to make a plan. <laughs> Nunavut Mute have been asked to make a plan to help ourselves in these systems we do not understand. All we are asking for is our basic human rights. Where is this support from leaders with power and ability to make change? Where are our non-Indigenous allies? Thank you, Madam Speaker.